Enforcement Directorate officials swooped down on the Muda office in Mysuru, scanning each and every file, each and every document associated with the 5050 land scam. And today they have recovered the crucial documents of Chief Minister Sidramaya's wife Parvati Sidramaya's documents as far as the land allotment is concerned. In fact, Sidramaya's brother in law is also facing the heat. Mr. Devraj, his house was also raided. And the BJP, meanwhile, claims that important documents have been burnt in Bengaluru by the Congress party. Here's the story. Big lead in the Muda scam probe as ED widens the probe ambit. In a fresh development, ED has obtained crucial evidence regarding Muda scam. ED has finally seized the original documents related to Chief Minister Siddharamaya's wife, Parvatamma. Enforcement Directorate officials have raided the uh, Muda office and Tashildar office and many other places in Mysore today. How would you like to react? No, we welcome it. If, if they are making a search, if they are making raids, we don't have any issues. Let them do it. Complainant Snehamayi Krishna says he has provided a lot of information regarding illegal money being involved in Muda case. Uh, how would you, uh, regarding the Sidramaya side case itself, how would you like to react? Ma'am, the site has been given when BJP was in power. So where is question of an site has been allotted by the BJP government? It's not only 14 sets, there are 125 sets been allotted. So if you see technically, there is nothing in this case. Among the documents acquired by the ED were two versions. One with the whiteout corrections and the other without, raising serious concerns over potential document tampering. According to top sources, the ED received the original documents without whiteout after an intense round of questioning. Two hard disks were also seized during the search. The original document that contained Parvati's signature includes a specific line outlining a request for a high value property in a prime Mysuru location. However, this line had been erased using a whitener, raising suspicions of tampering. Meanwhile, the ED officials raided the Bengaluru residence of J. Devaraj, the fourth accused in the Muda land scam case. The raid, which lasted over 12 hours, saw a team of four ED officials grilling Devaraj about the entire sale process.